viewers welcome to my channel this is Geetha today we will be solving a question from RRP 2002 question paper so I have solved this question already in a different method and now we are going to solve using a different method A can do a piece of work in 14 days and B in 21 days they began working together but three days before the completion of the work A leaves off so the total number of days to complete the work is question mark so to find this we have to find the LCM of 14 and 21 so the LCM can be found this different method so one of the methods that is continuous division method so finding the common term which is 7 7 times 2 is 14 7 times 3 is 21 so 7 times 2 is 14 and 14 times 3 is 42 so therefore lcm is equals 42 but to find the capacity of a the efficiency of a can be found by total work divided by the number of days taken to finish that work so here it's a 42 units of work which is the total work which has to be done so to find that so for a it is total work is 42 divided by number of days it will take it will take a can a will take us 14 so 42 divided by 14 is 3 units so you can do 3 units of work per day one day and for b it is 42 divided by 21 so which is equals for b efficiency of b is 42 divided by 21 which is equals 2 units of work per day so the question here is they begin together but three days before the completion of work that is the total number of days is question mark so if the total number of days taken is n so let n be the total number of days taken to finish the work so before three days minus three days is the number of work done by a plus b done the entire work for the total number of days b times n is equals the total unit of work which is 42 units so by simplifying this we can find the value of n that is the number of days work has to be done so which is a times n is a n minus 3a plus b n equals 42 so we know the value of a which is 3 units of per day and we know the value of b which is 2 units per day so substituting that values here so a is 3 n minus 3 into a is 3 plus b is 2 so 2 n so we can actually substitute this values here for the first time equals 42 so simplifying this so which is 3 n plus 2 n equals 5 n minus 3 times 3 is 9 equals 42 so 5 n equals 42 plus 9 which is equals 51 so 5 n equals 51 therefore n equals number of days taken by work is equals 51 divided by 5 which is equals 10 by 5 therefore the total number of days to complete the work is 10 1 by 5 thanks for watching if you have any doubts please let me know in the comments